Firefighters say the new Indiana Residential Building Code will help them out in a big way. The new changes go, are going into effect today and make homes safer for them and homeowners. Now, I talked to a West Lafayette firefighter to see how he and his employees are going to benefit from the new code. Firefighters never know what they're walking into when responding to an emergency. It's disproportionate the number of firefighters that are injured in basement fires compared, compared to fires on like a first and second floor of a structure because there are so many um, variables and unknowns as we go into a basement fire. The new building code, which went into effect on December 26th, requires all new residential builds must have an escape and rescue opening in the basement. Heat, smoke, products of combustion are coming. They, won't, they, have, they have to go somewhere. So they're coming up the stairs while the firefighters are trying to go down those stairs to fight that fire. So without some sort of form of egress, um, we're working against those uh, natural forces. But those aren't the only changes happening that will make things safer for fire personnel. There will also be a stronger separation between garages and homes. What the code's trying to do is prevent fires that may start in the garage from reaching the interior of the home. So we put you know, a heavier rating on that door that goes up into the attic that's normally in most garages. And that change is something firefighters say can save time, which is one of the most important things when fighting a fire. Life safety is all about time. And if we can increase you know, five or ten minutes of time between fire breaking through that barrier, then that's going to result in lives being saved and less property damage as well. The Indiana Residential Building Code hasn't been updated since 2003. The 2020 Building Code went into effect yesterday, and local building commissioners will take education classes on the new codes in January.